Hey, what's going on, everybody? Nightlord here, and we are back on Game of Thrones. Last time, we had riots, Mirror getting yelled at, plants leave the watch, a lot of backstabbing going on in the last episode. Let's see what those backstabbings do as we progress forward in the story. Anyways, with that being said, let's get into it. Okay, we are in. Here we go. Whew. We are in the forest. Hey! Griff White. Here we go. That snot nosed fourth born. Parading in here like a conquering fucking hero. It was bad enough when it was just the soldiers. We can't live with them under our roof. No, Spoiling our house. I know mm -hmm. you tried to stop them, my lord. But this occupation will break our people if it drags on. That's clearly what he wants. We can't let that scut rule this house. Like he's the cock and we're in his roost. Yeah. I'm no fool. I've seen the soldiers in our hut. And Whitehill's Brunt is at the front of the pack. So don't act as if I don't know how bad it is. Yeah. Of course not, my lord. But Griff Whitehill isn't the beginning of our troubles. Or the end of them. We need to look at all the pieces. White Hill men aren't just in our house. They've raided our lands, burnt farms, and cut down our trees. All the way from here to High Point. Wow. How do we kill a snake then? By smashing its head. Griff is in the head. It's his father. Perhaps. But Griff is here. We have access to him. And they have Ryan. Hmm. Yeah, we need to get him back. He carved these soldiers himself. Yep. Ramsay Snow killed Ethan. What's to yes, stop the White Hills from doing the same to Ryan at High Point? You can't forsake your safety. But we have to do something. My lord, at least give us a target to aim for. Hmm. Do you have a choice? So let's see, do we want him for expel Griffin? Save Ryan. I want to save my brother. We get Ryan out and bring him home. Once he's safe, we can face the White Hills head on. And what of Griff and his men? But we can only take this occupation for so long. If you think I'm giving up on Ironrath, you're wrong. By keeping this family together, Ironrath will stand. Yes. Roderick is right. We are nothing if we leave Ryan behind. Then... It's decided. We're bringing Ryan back. Yes, we are. We still don't have the men to hold our own home. Let alone Storm High Point. We lost most of our men with Gregor, at the Twins. Unfortunately, Roderick was not able to secure the backing of the Glenmores. That means we have to count on Asher and Mira. How? Asher means to sail home from Essos, with a company of hardened sellswords. But they're not bannermen. Okay. We'll need to pay them for it. Which is why Mira's part to play is just as crucial. She can get us the coin we need in King's Landing. You don't imagine we have the luxury of waiting for them. Asher and Mira are a long way from here. I have faith in my children. I don't think Lud Whitehall will kindly stand by while we pull well, ourselves together. Our to very them. lives and the future of House Forrester are at stake. We have to let them try. It's the only way. Then we yep. hold fast. The White Hills aren't ready for war. It won't be long before you're able to take action yourself. Well, one way or another, there's a fight brewing, so I have much to prepare and men to train. Yep, just my you. lord. I'm not sure that's good or bad. My mom's not saying anything. Hopefully, good. My lord, there may be something we can do now. A voice from High Point, Gwyn Whitehill. Lord Whitehill's daughter. The very same. After the hells that came from her and Asher. Despite all that, 
is willing to meet with you. I hope you trust me enough as Sentinel to consider this. It would be wise to hear what she has to say. Arrange a meeting. Yeah. What she has to say may prove useful. Okay, I believe she can be trusted. But best use caution nonetheless. Of course. And I'll make sure no one else knows. For now at least. Good call, good call. Good. Whew. Handle things right with Gwyn. And she may even help us in high point. When the time comes. Well, that'd be good. I feel that the last girl I tried to seduce it did not go my way. Did not get her back again. Did not get the marriage. I want the dove pie served with a spoon of lemon cream. We'll have to let the kitchens know. And these flowers. They're just all wrong in the crown lands. Mira, are you listening to me? Lady Marjorie, good tidings to you today. Thank you, Lord Tyrion. And you, Lady Mira, a word in private, if I may. I'll return her shortly. Who would I be to deny Lord Tyrion? Very soon you'll be the queen. And if you're anything like the current one, you'll deny me all you like. I'm sorry, Lord Tyrion, but Lady Marjorie needs me. Very well. Just know that matter we discussed? <clears throat> a royal decree sits on my desk now. I'll have my squire Podrick see to it at the first opportunity. No, thank you. I thought you would want to know. Good news on a day that is already blessed. Thank you for telling me, Lord Tyrion. Oh, one more thing. The most valuable favor is a favor unspent. Perhaps I'll call on you for a dance at the wedding feast. Enjoy the festivities. Goodbye, Lord Tyrion. Lady Marjorie? Welcome to the family, for better or worse. Lord Tyrion, if you'd only shared some wine with Tyrion, why does he come to you now? What's this talk of a royal decree? You know I didn't want you talking to him. Today of all days. Lord Tyrion is helping my family, my lady. So it may seem, but he's exceedingly cunning, Mira. Don't think you know all he's up to. House Forrester already has so few friends at court, and when this decree becomes public, you may find you have even fewer. You disappoint me, Mira. We'll talk mm. about this after the wedding. Sarah will help me with my gown and hair. <laughs> Dang. Come with me, Sarah. Wow. That's horrible. Well, dang, why did I go with Tyrion then? He just left me anyways. Gary! Easy now. Sorry. I was just... keeping at the ready. That's good. Don't lose that. I understand your uncle pays you a visit. What did he want? Not many people pass through here. What brought him this far? There's news that House Forrester is in trouble. I'm sorry to hear it, but you have to leave all that behind. Especially now that you're a ranger. Aye. I know you had told me you could stand with these men, but not every brother's a friend, if it came to it. And you were in trouble north of the wall. Any of them you'd trust by your side. You know these men. Who do you want watching your back? Well, I know I can count on you, John. Yeah, I'm flattered. But our paths may not always cross. You'll need allies beside you. Errol's Holt of White Harbor, Corliss Wells from Stony Sept. And finally, we've got more spawn of nobility joining us. No. Britt Warwick of House Whitehill. It can't be. House Whitehill. Make sure you're not bringing this one to the Baltics. There'll be a hot meal in the mess hall. After that, we'll be sorting out gear at the armory. Gary. Be practice swords to Gary, start. what's the matter? Don't want anyone you know it. Come on, get moving. Gary, who is he? That man murdered my family. What? Snow! See these new recruits to the maester. Don't do something you regret. Wow. Interesting.
If it isn't the fucking pig farmer. I'm here because of you. Got sent to the wall for that little party I did with your family. Don't think it's over. Best watch your back. What are you waiting for, recruit? Personal invitation from the king? Yep. Welcome to the wall. Brother, looking forward to it. That's enough. I oh. said move. Let's get going, guys. I'll be seeing you, farm boy. Being intense, guys. So we're gonna see what comes out of this one. This isn't fair. We were supposed to be up there. I'll never see another wedding like this. No, I don't won't. know what you did with Tyrion Lannister that made Cersei want to punish you. But it never should have affected me like this. I'm so sorry. I had no idea any of this would happen. But what Tyrion Lannister did for me, it may have saved my family. I hope that's true, Mira. I really do. Because you don't know how furious Marjorie is at you. When I was getting her dressed for the wedding, she was talking about who she could replace you with. Whoa. I probably shouldn't have even told you. But I suppose you have a right to know. I can handle this. She's only thinking about it, right? There's still time. Look, you once promised to help me with Marjorie when our positions were reversed. That meant everything to me. Maybe now I'm in a position to help you. Otherwise, Marjorie's going to make you leave King's Landing. You're pushing her to it, Mira. And I can't let you. Thank you, Sarah. I could really use a hand right now. Thank you. I don't want to do this all alone. Don't worry. We'll figure this out. I'll beg Marjorie if I have to. Wow. I'm good with that. Not letting her send you home. Is that Marjorie? Look. Props the for that. Pie. Oh no. They're already serving a pie. Oi. We're missing everything. I know you. You were in the gardens the other night with Damien. Before he disappeared. I have a few questions to ask you. What were you doing there with him? Mira? Don't think I don't know it was you. So what if I was with him? Uh, seven health. <sighs> you there, girl. I need a towel or a wet cloth, something. Lord Morgren. You'll need to find someone else. I'm not finished Are with you her. you sick, man? Do you think I have time to bother with handmaidens? Release her, or I'll have Queen Cersei find you another job. Wow. That's rough. Very rough. And thank God he's on my side. Well, I just ruined a perfectly good shirt to come to your rescue. No need to explain what that was all about. We all have our own mischief to yes, hide. That was kind of you. I do appreciate it. Well, I didn't do it merely for your benefit. Then why? Perhaps I recognize the kindred spirit. It's not every little handmaiden who can steal an ironwood decree with the crown right out from under my nose. Oh, wow. Well. Consider me impressed. My partners... I'm afraid to say, felt rather differently about it. That ironwood was stolen from my family. It was never yours to sell. Spoken with strength, my lady. But still, I wonder if you're ready to play this game. Yes, I will be. Do you even understand why Tyrion gave you the ironwood deal? Because it wasn't out of the kindness of his heart. I know fool. He wants something from me. Access to Marjorie. Or, perhaps he just knew he could get the cheapest iron with him. Very mm. observant. You are no mere handmaiden. I remember what it was like to be new to this game. You feel like you're drowning, don't you? Yes, There's no one you can really trust. What you need, more than anything, is an ally. I could be that for you, Lady Mira. Is that something you'd be interested in? 
an alliance can mean many things, my lord. I would be a fool to say yes without knowing what I was saying yes to. Wisely put. <laughs> so, let me be blunt. Circumstances have put us at odds. So, but what if we were to work together? Control the price of ironwoods together. We could get very, very rich together. Or should I go back to Lord Whitehall? Who has proven to be very interested in it? No, oh, Jeffrey died, guys. Now the purple wedding's happening. Apparently, can't get married in this game or in this world. What happened? Oh, I'm afraid it just became a very bad time to be linked to Tyrion Lannister. Tell me that you got that Ironwood decree from him before the wedding. Oh no. He said it was waiting for me on his desk. <sighs> what a shame. Such potential. I'm afraid any chance of our alliance has become quite impossible. You understand, Lady Mira. I can get it. I'll get it back from his chamber. That would not be an easy task. That's true. Especially now. But if it were to disappear, perhaps we could talk again. Okay, then. You have a good head for business, Lady Mira. It'd be terribly disappointing to see it on the end of a pike. Oh jeez, where are we going to guys? So not turning so hot for me. It's locked. <gasps> not getting in this way. Tom! What in seven hells do you think you're doing up here? Hmm. What are you thinking? You've got to leave. Now. Tom, I'm in trouble. There's something inside I need to get. If I don't, it's going to be a nightmare. Yep. Damn it. Whatever trouble you're in could be trouble for me too. So what do we do? Don't think about it. I have an idea. The terrace. The what? I could maybe climb across the roof and drop down onto the outside terrace. It's just... I don't know where. Is whatever's in there really worth risking my life for? It's not just kings who die stupidly round here. No, it's not worth your life. Thank you for saying that. I guess I better not die then. Wait here. I'll be at the door before you know it. Well, thank you, Tom. Just be careful. Just what do you think you're doing here? You shouldn't be anywhere near this place. Don't you know the imp has murdered the king? I... I was just... I just needed to get away. After everything that's happened, it was terrible. I'm sure you did. I'm not going to ask you again. <laughs> Oi! Whoever's in there, I command you to open this door at once, in the name of the king! Hmm. You! Don't move! Tom! It's me! Hurry! God, that was close. I almost didn't make it back down here. Some tiles okay. on the roof came loose. I almost lost my footing. Thank you, Tom. That was awesome. I could never have done this without you. Hey, good job, Tom. I'm looking for a piece of paper. A royal decree! Well, go on! That Lannister guard could be back with help any second. I'll keep watch outside the door. Tom! You can do this. Oh, okay, let's do this really quickly. Hum, 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 hum. The desk. Come on, something worthwhile. He said that it would be on his desk! Letter from 
I win Lannister. It's the bill for the wedding. This is more money than I could spend in a lifetime. Jeez. Mira. Tyrion Strongbox. Oh, it must be in here. Mira. I think the Lannister guard is back. Oh, no, it's the other one. Damn it. Hide. I'll find a way to distract them. I'm telling you, I heard someone in here. Search the place. We'll find them. And after? Now that we've got the imp's keys, we can have a little look inside his lockboxes, eh? <laughs> My. Hmm. Help! Fire! What the hell? Damn it! Come on! I lit a tapestry on fire, down the hall. I bought you a minute, maybe two. Oh, thank you. Thank God. Did you find it? Oh, I think... I think it has to be in here. Oh, it has to be. Oh! Come on! If I move the key, I can get it in. No, no, no. Just hurry! That time's a charm. <gasps> it worked! Like this? Oh, thank the God! Oh, I found it! Finally! Let's go! <coughs> I catch the bastard who... Oh, bring their bloody neck! Jeez. Ooh, what happened, guys? Ooh. Okay, so, we finished up there. We found the order, hopefully. It says for us, so... Fingers crossed, guys. Thanks for watching, guys, and like always, if you like this episode, give me a thumbs up. As well, don't forget to check out my friends' channels and Twitch accounts in the box with their links in the box below. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Have a great night. Bye.